Hi there, this is Mary Stevenson, the Director of Early College for College of Eastern Idaho. And this video is going to help you get registered and admitted to CEI for your dual credit classes. We're gonna walk really quick through the steps so that you know exactly what you need to do for your first and then ongoing classes with CEI. So first of all, I'm gonna share my screen and we're gonna pop over to the main website for um, College of Eastern Idaho. So go to cei.edu and then on the blue line at the top, you'll select early college. We do change our website from uh, now and then. So make sure that you're just going to the early college page. And then also sometimes our pictures do change as we promote different things. So just make sure that you're on early college and you're gonna go right into this uh, first button here that is how to register for classes. So we have a multi-step process for students. And um, the first thing you have to do when you take your very first class from CEI is you need to get enrolled. Also, we call that admissions. This is how you become a student with our college and that you get a Falcon ID number from us. So um, that's a one-time only process and then you'll do registration every term. So admissions happens once, registration happens any term that you take a class from us at the beginning of the term. So starting with admissions, you're gonna go and just click on this button here. It's gonna take you into the admissions application. If you click right here, here's a big tip. We have a step-by-step -step guide. So some of you, this might be the first time you've ever done an application like this. You're gonna go in, you'll create an account. This step-by-step -step guide will take you through all of the answers, but here's a couple of tips. Please use a personal email, not your school email, and um, make sure it's something that you can check. You'll need to answer any question that has an, a red asterisk. Please try to answer everything, but those are the ones that are required. And when you get to the school part, uh, just know that this is a national database that it pulls in. So make sure you choose the Idaho school. So um, for instance, if you chose Hillcrest, there's got, going to be a Hillcrest in Utah as well. So make sure you're choosing um, the school in Idaho that you go to. And then the program is the other big one. You'll choose whatever term is appropriate to when you're starting, but you wanna make sure that you're doing the high school early college program. That's how you're gonna be charged uh, the right tuition that your advanced opportunities will cover. So then this is just gonna help you walk through the rest of those questions. Um, and then back here on the instructions, it does tell you it processing takes up to 48 hours. Sometimes it's really quick though. So once you do that admissions application, just be watching your email that you used to sign up. You'll get an email back that says, welcome to CEI, here's your ID number, and your next step is to register for classes. Okay, so once you have that, you're done. Just make sure you write that ID number down. You're gonna need it. And then this is the process to register for classes that you'll do each term. So first of all, it tells you to select classes. So if you're in a dual credit class you're, you, at your high school, you already know you're in, you know what your class is. If you're going to be taking a class directly from CEI, this link takes you into the CEI uh, class catalog so that you can look at the schedule of uh, upcoming classes. Um, step number two is really important that you know your prerequisites and you know that you're eligible. So just review these two items to make sure that uh, you qualify to take the classes that you're interested in. I am going to show you really quick on the prerequisite list. So this is a list that we produce for early college classes. These are the most common classes that students take from us um, as dual credit or early college. So uh, this is not every single prerequisite, but it's the one you'll run into the most. So for instance, if you're going to take English 102, we need proof that you successfully completed English 101 with a C minus or higher, or that you earned a three, four, or five on an AP English language test, or you have a, an appropriate SAT or ACT score. So you can just scroll through here to look at the different prerequisites that are appropriate. And then right here at the top, it tells you how to submit those prerequisites along with your registration form for uh, uh, to the college. So make sure that you qualify to take the classes that you're in. And then the actual form that you fill out is right here. It's the registration request form. So you click on that and the first page is instructions. The second page is the form. This is a fillable document. So you can type all of your information in here, including that Falcon ID number, your CEI ID. Uh, just check anything that is, that is applicable to you. This is where you'll write your course information. And then it has to be signed by the student, the parent, and your counselor needs to sign it. And then the last step is just to take a quick picture of this form once it's complete and email it to this email address at the bottom of the form. Um, our office is open regular business hours, eight to five. If you ever have a question, please feel free to call us. 
And all of our information, contact information is found down here. You can also schedule an advising appointment, but that is how you get registered for CEI. Let us know if you have any questions. The phone number is 208-535-5309. Thanks.